Oh my god, oh my god, we are all fucked. Have you heard of monkeypox? There's this new thing called monkeypox and we're all going to be locked down forever. I'm telling you, forever. You thought the <laughs> was bad? Wait for fucking monkeypox. Actually, I don't know fucking dick about monkeypox. I'm just being hyperbolic. But I was reading Pink News before because that's my favourite LGBTQIA plus two-spirit website. And it taught me a thing or two about monkeypox. Would you like to know a thing or two about monkeypox? Well, here goes. Monkeypox outbreaks across Europe linked to gay sauna and fetish festival. That's it. I am cancelling every single gay sauna and fetish festival I have booked in for the next six years. Because I'm doing my part, you know. I don't want to contribute to the spread of monkeypox. I don't want to contribute to the end of the world. And if YouTube's listening, I'm not giving medical advice. I'm just saying monkeypox sounds fucked. And I don't want to be any part of monkeypox. Anyway, here's a quick sponsor. Then we're going to read this pink news article. Hearing, 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 hearing. A popular video conferencing app is getting sued for an $85 million settlement after breaking privacy rights. Millions of the platform's users joined together to file a class action lawsuit after the tech company sold their user data to social media companies. It feels like every day a new company is violating your rights. Your own personal data has never been more at risk than now. Today's sponsor, Virtual Shield, helps keep users anonymous online. When Virtual Shield is on, internet activity is encrypted, which keeps hackers and data tracking corporations at bay. Even ISPs can't get around Virtual Shield. And get this, Virtual Shield has a strict no log policy, zero hidden fees, and it's fast and secure. I personally let Virtual Shield run in the background of my computer all day. It just gives me that extra layer of safety. If you've been looking for a way to browse the internet anonymously, you'll love Virtual Shield. Right now, they're offering 50% off to my subscribers for life. And if you sign up today, you'll get a free 30-day trial. Just go to hidewithbear.com or visit the link down below. Monkey pox. That's right. Monkey. <laughs> monkey pox. <laughs> Outbreaks across Europe linked to gay sauna and fetish festivals. And then there's this picture of someone with a with a sore on their hand, which was apparently taken back in 2015. You can Google this shit. But no medical misinformation here, Google. I promise. I'm just having a laugh about monkey pox. Health authorities in Spain have attributed the majority of... <laughs> monkeypox infections in the country to a single outbreak in a now closed gay sauna in the Madrid region. At least 30 cases of monkeypox have so far been confirmed across Spain with Britain, Portugal and the US also reporting a surge in the cases of the rare viral infection. So hang on a sec, how does this work? Is monkeypox attributed to gay dudes fucking in saunas or is this like and again, Google, you're going to have to excuse me. This isn't like gay dudes fucking monkeys, is it? Hey! Like that whole initial AIDS conspiracy. Like we're not talking Freddie Mercury the second 69ing a fucking monkey in a sauna. Surely that's not the case. There's people on the street get diseases from monkeys. Yeah, that's what I said, they get diseases from monkeys. Now there's junkies with monkey disease. Who's touching these monkeys? Please leave these poor sick monkeys alone. They got problems enough as it is. And are the monkeys gay or are they just doing what they're told? I tell you what, ladies and gentlemen, I'm not going into fucking lockdown for some fucking gay monkey pox. All right, I did lockdown for River Rona, River Rona Teen, and that was fucked. I'm not doing it for monkeys. Fuck you. <laughs> okay. Fuck you, monkeys. The UK Health Security Agency noted that cases have predominantly been found in gay and bisexual men, but have been clear that monkeypox usually poses little risks as the majority of patients make a full recovery. Well, what about the monkeys? What about the monkeys? The ones that are giving the initial pox. Is this going to mutate? Is there going to be monkeypox mark two? Cancel all flights. Everyone stay home. You've got to order your shit from fucking Coles Online or whatever the fuck your supermarket is. Get fucked. Because there's monkeys out there having sex with gay men. <laughs> Not that I've got anything against gay men. You go be gay men. That's fine. But monkeys... Wait, did I just make this up? Is this actually from someone fucking a monkey? Or have I just convinced myself into this? Again, YouTube, 
This is not medical misinformation. This is a comedy show and I am being comedic, all right? Fuck off. 23 new cases were confirmed in Spain on Friday, May 20, with regional health chief Enrique Riuzzi Escurado telling reporters that most of the cases have been traced from a single adult sauna used by queer men for sex, according to Reuters or Reuters. Escuardo confirmed that the Public Health Department of Spain will be carrying out further analysis to control contagion, cut the chains of transmission and try to mitigate the transmission of this virus as much as possible. I think we need to round up all the monkeys and build them their own gay sex saunas. And why do gay men want to have sex in saunas anyway? Wouldn't it get a bit fucking hot? God, I guess the sweat is like a natural lubricant. Oh. Go outside or something. Go out into the backyard and have your gay sex out there. Just make sure you've got like hedges or appropriately high fences and keep them moaning to a minimum. I'm not being homophobic here. I'm not spreading medical misinformation. I'm just speaking my mind. Don't have sex with monkeys, gay men. <laughs> 15 of the cases in Spain and the Madrid region, with another 18 suspected cases under investigation across the country. The Extremadura region confirmed its first case on Friday and 23 cases have been noted in neighbouring Portugal. Oh! Authorities have also confirmed the first case of monkeypox in Belgium, which have been linked to visitors of the Darklands Fetish Festival. See, there you go. The Darklands Festival. Fetish festival. You know they've got bum chaps there. They're the arseless chaps and chains and fucking Belgian steamers and, and oils and shit like that. Which took place from the 4th to the 9th of May. The health department of the Belgian government has confirmed three cases of monkeypox virus linked to visitors of the Darklands. Read a statement on the festival's website. There's reason to assume that the virus has been brought by visitors from abroad to the festival after recent cases in other countries. Around Around 100 cases of monkeypox, which is rarely found outside parts of Central and West Africa, because that's where fucking monkeys live, have been detected across Europe. While some have been associated with overseas travel, UK health officials believe that local cases are a result of transmission through the LGBTQ plus M community. That stands for monkey, because monkeys are part of the community now. As the summer approaches, Dr. Hans Kluja. Ooh, oh, I like what you are doing to me at this very dirty festival, Dr. Hans Kluja. Ooh, ooh, yes, more on the nipple. More on the nipple. The World Health Organization, WHO, Regional Director for Europe, is concerned that the transmission could accelerate, with mass gatherings, festivals and parties as the cases currently being detected are among those engaging in sexual activity with monkeys. And the symptoms are unfamiliar to many. That's because they're fucking monkeys. Don't fuck monkeys. Again, I don't even know if this disease is from fucking monkeys, but it's called monkey pox. So, I mean, you'd kind of assume. And they do some weird things at these saunas. Again, I'm not against gay people. You do what you want. You have your saunas. You have your dark festivals. You even invite some monkeys, but just like, just, just keep it above the belt, you know? I would like to emphasize that individuals contracting monkeypox must not be stigmatized for fucking monkeys or discriminated against in any way for fucking monkeys. He continued, Timely risk communication with the general public is important and public health bodies should widely disseminate accurate and practical advice on the prevention, diagnosis and treatment of not fucking monkeys. Don't fuck monkeys. Again, I don't know if this disease is about fucking monkeys, but it sounds like it's about fucking monkeys. Dr. Kluja urged anyone who is concerned about an unusual rash to consult their healthcare provider or local veterinary clinic. <laughs> I'm going to leave it there. I don't know if this is about fucking monkeys. All right, do not take this as medical advice. YouTube, again, this is, this is meant to be comedy. I'm probably not even that funny, but just please don't ban me. I'm just taking the piss. Anyway, until next time, don't fuck monkeys. Ta-ta. Recession, session. Give me better times, give me better times. Recession, session.